Sacramento County residents still experiencing financial hardship can now apply to a second round of the Sacramento Emergency Rental Assistance Program. From March of 2020 until March of uh, this year, also uh, people may qualify for future rent, which will cover uh, April, May and June of this year. Criteria for this assistance is based on income per household and in order to qualify, you can't exceed that limit. Priority will be given to households that owe rental arrears like Sandra's. It's almost 5000 in total and my bills, rent and, you know, everything is now the gas is so expensive. Who, even though has been working on and off throughout the pandemic, has struggled to make ends meet. It's affected a lot because uh, in my job is reducing the hours for me and it's only two, three days a week, only uh, four, four hours and a day. I don't know. It's, it's terrible. <laughs> Additionally, applicants must have at least one household member that qualifies for unemployment benefits or has experienced financial hardship due to COVID-19 and demonstrate housing instability. Help is available to anyone in the county despite their immigration status, and La Familia Counseling Center is available to help with the application process. The Hispanic community many times don't take advantage of these benefits uh, for one reason and another. So yes, even if they don't have uh, legal documents, uh, they can still apply. Required documents for tenant application include a photo ID, current utility bills showing amounts owed, documentation of all current household income for the past two months, and a valid email address. There's still no deadline to apply. However, the sooner residents apply, the sooner they can receive some of this financial assistance. Any unused funds will be sent back to state and federal government. In Sacramento, Maricela de la Cruz, KCRA 3 News.